Hey, what is up, YouTube? This is Chris or Lunar Man, and there's no webcam today because I have to um, get money to buy XSplit. I'm using Fraps right now. Um, but what I'm doing right now is I'm playing with a dude that contacted me over YouTube, and he was like, "Yo, you want to do a like a like a like a duo kind of thing going on? I don't remember the name. <laughs> um, uh, what is it? It's on the tip of my tongue." It's a collaboration, that's what it is. It's like, you want to do a collaboration? And I'm like, yeah, sure, I'll do a collaboration. So what we're doing is we are playing the best two out of three, and I'm against Segun, and he is also starting doing Hearthstone. Um, so this will be fun. Um, and I'm using a... It's like a ramp druid deck, but it's just a late game druid deck, so we'll see how his deck is and see what he does. But... Um, yeah, he doesn't really have much to do on turn one, and I'm definitely going to use this. Um, but yeah, other news, I'm done with finals, you guys saw the video on that. I will have a, um, Photoshop slash Illustrator tutorial coming up, and just different things like that. I got a new mouse, I got a Steel Series Sensei, um, I'm going to go ahead and destroy this. But yeah, it's super, super sensitive. Like, you can see, like, right here. Like, I'm barely even moving it. But, <clears throat> alright, so what a, what a Pelican... Let me let me talk about the game. Let me shut up about me. And let me, like, try to teach you guys about... Of my Hearthstone knowledge. Um, turn 4, he will probably be able to play the Hammer of Wrath. It won't kill me, but he'll get it to draw a card. Um, what's he doing with this? Ooh, that's nice. Okay. I probably would have waited to do that all next turn, although I might not have let him get that opportunity. Um, but right now, I can play my Harvest Goal, and I can buff up my guy, and just go straight to the face, because this will leave him with a taunt that he has to deal with. And um, I get 4 damage. So... Yeah, so he'll probably have to attack to face. It'll get me down to two. He'll have the Divine Shield. He could play Hammer of Wrath, finish me off. Um, he could play another one of these guys. He probably has Consecration. Um, Consecration wouldn't really be good against this right now. And he could always play Blessing of Kings. Just different things. He could play a Secret. But he may not have that many. He may not have that many cards because he's. I guess he might be new at this game. But I think I have a little bit more cards than him. Blah. All right. So that leaves him with one health. Um. I'm just gonna use this. Get the card draw. And I'll probably just go straight for face again because he's gonna have to attack into this. Um, yeah, I'll probably just go straight to face. Kill this thing off. And my turn. I'll probably play a different deck next game. I'll show you three different decks that I have, that I've made right now. Um, <coughs> alright, so right now he could play Consecration. It would get rid of this guy, but it wouldn't get rid of this guy, so I don't think it'd be the best move. Um, that's a pretty good move, because it's just like, you know, throw it away. But, unfortunate for him, that's definitely not the biggest taunt I will have this game. As you can see in my hand, I have the Sunwalker, and he's pretty huge. I've got both of my Starfires. I don't really have anything exciting right now. I've got three. Starfall, Starfire. Um, I think I'm going to kill this thing. I'll probably just play this guy. But he's pretty annoying. He'll probably, if, I mean, I don't know, I'd probably run him into him, get rid of the Divine Shield, and um, go from there. That's not bad. Although I kind of have something to answer back. Ah, oh, Brandon, you've made it into one of my videos. Okay, so yeah, I'll probably just do this right here. Get the draw. The card draw. Oh yeah, my legendary. I got this dude like two days ago. 
He's pretty sweet, yo. Um, this is my first legendary. Actually, no, I take that back. I think I got Deathwing, but I was like, this is like the worst legendary ever. So I sold it, and this is my new first legendary ever. So, but yeah, I will be interested to watch his video to see his commentary. Hopefully he doesn't talk trash about me, haha. <laughs> nah, it'll probably be pretty cool. But, that's a pretty decent card, with the Divine Shield and everything. Um, <laughs> I like that. Um, let's see, let's see. Probably, I don't know, I kind of just want to get rid of the Divine Shield, so I'll probably just do this. And, actually, I'm going to do Innervate and do this guy. And I'm just going to go for face. Actually, no, I'm going to kill this guy. Because he can always buff up his 1-1s one with the uh, Blessing of Kings. Which is really annoying, but really good. So. There's the Consecration. That's actually pretty good. It gives her the three of my creatures. He'll be able to do this, so I'll have one creature left. It's not bad. Not a bad play. I'm going to save this for uh, another taunt. I don't want to use it on him because it'll just give me another 5-6. So I'll save that. I think I have two in this deck anyway. Um, but yeah, hopefully this season... See, there's a big one right there. Hopefully this season I will be able to get to... And he's actually almost dead. Hopefully this season I'll be able to get to like rank... I want to get to rank 10. I got to rank 14 as my highest last season. But after that, it got kind of hard. Like, people, you know, had the legendaries and the stuff like that. And, like, the rush decks are in the meta right now. So I'm like, I want to make a deck that counters the meta, which is kind of like this one. But I think if you make a late game warrior or late game priest deck, you will counter the meta. Because they can both essentially heal themselves. There's another consecration. It's not really going to do that much. Um, I don't really... Nah, he doesn't have much to do that. So I'll just do right there. Alright, next game I'll use a different deck. Because this deck is kind of really strong. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Um, I don't like the Zoo deck. The Tempo deck is really fun. But, yeah. I don't really know what he means by got nothing. What do you mean? I use the rogue tempo. I saw this off of. I get most of my deck lists off offline. Um, unfortunately, I kind of cheat that way. I don't know. Is it cheating or is it not cheating? I'm really bad at making decks, so I don't think it's cheating. Um. So let's put this up. And do I want to put this up? Ah, uh, that's not. It's unfortunate. Eh, I should have kept the Harvest Golem. I, oh, I got it back. Heh. <laughs> That's funny. Play the Argent Squire. I got this for, like, super late. Like, I don't even want this right now. I got this for turn 4, this for turn 3. I guess I can play this on turn 2. Yeah, I'll take that dude out. Ah, Faceless Manipulator. Just destroy that thing. Break some windows. I love breaking those. Turn off the light. Alright, so Hunter decks. The main Hunter deck that's in the meta right now is a... Basically a Rush Hunter deck. Um, which involves... As the Hunter, you try to... Actually, I don't want to do that. But as the Hunter, you try... And... Basically get the combo with star uh, starving scavenging buzzard starving buzzard I don't know the scavenging hyena and then the unleash the hounds and timber wolf all at the same time and you just like ram him in his face so it's kind of like a rush uh, a rush deck um, definitely good right now but it's kind of risky so I don't I have it but I don't really like playing it that much I might show it to you guys next um, I don't know it depends if I win this one I don't know if he'll want to do a third because we're doing best out of three so if I win two in a row then that would be it, but I don't know. Maybe we'll play another one. Hopefully we will. That'll be fun. 
I got the cool card backs. Ah, oh, that's a nice one. I like that. Yeah, I was about to say, he needs to hit me in the face with that. <coughs> um, luckily for me, though, I'm just going to do this right here. That's a good trade-off. If I get another creature and his 4-2 is gone, and I get a taunt out. Um, I don't know why, but I just like drawing cards. But yeah, I got the card back. Uh, not concede right here from Pandaria for getting to rank 20. I'm pretty sure anybody that played ranked could get it. It's just kind of cool. All right, that's a pretty good combo. He got his card draw. Ooh, I like cold blood. Um, I'm probably gonna kill the buzzard for sure. I don't really want to kill it with this though, so I'll probably do the weapon. Probably play the Argent Squire. And I kind of want to cold blood this guy. I think I will. So kill the buzzard. Um, go face. And just go face. Cause like that's not enough to kill him. What what could he have? He could have a deadly shot. That destroy a random minion. He could have a multi shot, deal three damage to two random minions. He could have an arcane shot, deal two damage to any target. Um, he could have a stampeding Kodo, which would destroy one of these two. Or he could have a secret. I am not going to attack that with this guy because it could be a freezing trap, could be an explosive trap, could be a snipe. I don't know. Could be all kinds of stuff, but I'll probably attack it with. This first, actually, because I'm kind of curious to see. Um, wait, let me. Nah, I'll do this. Okay, well, it doesn't trigger. On. I should have attacked him first with the other guy. Ah, uh, misdirection. Well, that works. <laughs> That's probably who I was gonna attack with anyway. Uh, sorry, dude. Um, I'll do that. And I'm actually going to copy my 7-5. Get another 7-5. Um, thank you. I don't know. You guys have to tell me if I have shared enough knowledge with you all about Hearthstone. I like I like teaching people how to do things. Um, so he's got a, that's actually pretty good. He's got a 4-3 with taunt now, so I can't, I can't kill him, but I have sap, so I can kill him. Um, but he's going to concede. Just ask him if he's going to do one more. Oh, sweet, return all minions to their own hands. Gold one. <laughs> okay, sure. One more. I feel bad sometimes for winning. <laughs> um, let me use my... I'll use my Rushdown Hunter deck. Although, which one has the... I think, no, I think I want to use this one, the mid-game hunter. I think the mid-game hunter has the uh, combo with Scavenging Hyena and the Hounds. I think the Rushdown doesn't have any Hounds. Which doesn't make any freaking sense, but... Alright, so you definitely want this card. Definitely want this card. Uh, I don't want this card right now. Oh, nice, Timberwolf. Now I just need to uh, unleash the Hounds and Starving Buzzard. Alright, so Rogue, um, I'll go ahead and use Flare, because he's not going to have any secrets. I mean, he could have Stealth, but, uh, oh well. Stampede and Kodo, nice. But, I don't really want to play these alone, because he'll just pick them off with this, so I'm going to have to wait a while. So I might get pretty low, I might actually lose this game. Just because whenever you play this deck, you usually play it all at the same time. I don't want to play this yet because I don't necessarily need anything yet because he doesn't have any creatures, so I'm going to save it until later. Because I might draw it like next turn and then use this for something else. I don't know. Because another good card in this deck is the Hunter's Mark. Make a minion's health uh, 1. 
so that the this card right here so that the um I'll just hit him in the face again with that <coughs> excuse me but this is good for big taunts like if you play unleash the hounds and then use this on like the 88 eight tree it's an 81 tree and you can kill it with the unleash the hounds it's pretty nice uh the elven archer all right so if I get Unleash the Hounds, I just need to wait like two or three more turns. Because it seems like he's going to pile the board up with minions. But I can't let him do too much damage to me s too soon. Um, kill Command's nice. I think I will track right now. Because I do want the Unleash the Hounds. Ooh, the Starving Buzzard though. I could play this and save myself a little bit but the savannah high main is really good too but i think i'm not going to go for the savannah high main i'm going to do i think i want to do this so i don't take nah i want the starting buzzard all right so there's three pieces of the puzzle um i'll just do this again i just need the unleash the hounds yo but that just kind of sorted through my deck. They got rid of three cards off the top, so maybe I could top deck unleash, top deck hounds. But I mean, even another thing I could do is I could play this, play this, play this, and actually I'm gonna play him next turn. He's a pretty big card, and he'll destroy one of them. Oh, nice. Um, I think I'm gonna do this though, because I'll destroy one of them instantly. Hopefully it'll be him. No, okay. Um, I'll probably play him next turn, just waiting for the Unleash. Actually, no, I'll probably play the Buzzard, then the Grizzly. Just to get the card draw. Never know what yeah, I'm taking a lot of damage. I need to, like, do something fast. Uh, I'm already down to 10. Give me Unleash! Ah! I'll do Buzzard. Iron Fur. Got flare, nice. Use flare. Um, there we go. Hopefully my buzzard stays in play. Um, I'm actually going to kill this. Uh, wait, I didn't do that right. I should have killed this one. Whoops. Oh well. Next turn you will see the combo. I might not have a buzzard, but you will see the combo. Because he can just attack him and him and then uh, that. If he, I mean, I don't want to make him sound like he's stupid, but if he's smart, he'll kill this and then destroy the buzzard. But it looks like he might want to do this and then do that guy to my face. Um, because I don't know why he'd do that. Oh, okay. Well, I'm probably going to do a lot of damage to him right now. Okay, so I'm going to do... Hyena. Um, Unleash. Timberwolf. And then I'll do... Oh, my other Unleash. I'll do the other Unleash. Alright, so... And then boom, 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 boom. So now the tides have turned. I'm still really low, but okay, what do you say? That's what my hunter deck loves. I'm not really sure what he means like that, but I'm assuming he means that he loves this <coughs> style of gameplay. I don't know if this answers your question, bro, but that's what I'm going to say back. <laughs> um, Alright, well, he destroyed my rifleman, or my, uh, what's his face? Sent my scavenging hyena back to my hand. Or did he? I thought he used sap to scavenging hyena. Where is it at? What did he revive? Oh, I had too many cards in my hand. Poop. <laughs> too many cards in my hand. F. All right. Sorry about that. It sucks. Um, I wish I had another um hyena. 
Do I have Flare? What is this, Animal Companion? I think I'm gonna play the Animal Companion. I'll kill this thing. Animal Companion. Sweet. Yes, I got it back. And then another Timberwolf. Alright, so. Now I've got him on the ropes. Probably play this next turn. Probably play Timberwolf next turn. Probably play this next turn. And I think it'll probably be... be it'll probably be GG. Oh, he's got a taunt. Two taunts. Yeah, that's GG though. Um, Leoc. The Hound Master, so... Actually... Eh, I'll just play him for fun. I don't really need to play him. Alright, so my thing's full. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of funny, because once you start drawing all these cards, you just like... Um, like, get the whole deck. Alright, well that was the three games. Um, thank you guys for watching. Um, tell me if you enjoy Hearthstone. I mean, I'm sure most of you do, but yeah. I'll see you guys later. Peace.